Good evening, my dear friends. Today, in this topic, I am going to talk on a particular thing which will make interest in everybody. If you are new to my channel, please hit on the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you will, guys, you will not miss videos whenever I upload your videos. Okay? So, let us get started with the topic. Now, the basic question of when, where and how, this is a 3 minute talk. Well, the importance of when, where and how is that, in history, we would have heard about when, where and how, and why it is applicable, because this topic is going to implement in today's what I am going to talk. Before that, understand why I am talking on this topic, because when you have chosen a topic or when you ask to present something, don't do just for the sake of doing. Because 90% people have to do that, they do just for the sake of doing. So this is the wrong thing. So this is why I always have a procedure. Let's start with the procedure, basic question when, where and how, then with the topic. So that it will be easier to understand in what way this topic is going to benefit. This is how I make a YouTube strategy. Now, where it is applicable? all over the world because all over the world means whether in workplaces whether in the shops or in gym anywhere this is important to say that where comes anywhere in the world whether it is public whether in an airplane whether in a shop wherever around the world this is to say that how things differ as per the time because we can see a drastic change in today's reality that how Times have changed according to it, isn't it? Basically, you always think that starting with a basic question implies all the topics will be covered within a short period of time. Because, for example, if you are going for playing a cricket or whatever the football or tennis or whatever uh, sports you are going to play, Without knowing a thing, if you are going to take that, it's just a waste of time. How much ever you work on it, it will only end up in a failure. So try to avoid such kind of mistakes. So this is this is a question of when, where. Finally, the question comes how and why. How means how it is applicable because there are each competitors in a world where we can surely say that this it, it applies it applies like this it can go in any process this is the basic strategy now whenever we, we start with a topic let us always have these kinds of questions in our mind so that it can create interest in every people well in my strategy, I always start like why, when, where, and how, so that it will give a benefit to the people. Because in my cases, I have seen also other YouTubers who, do, who don't even start with this kind of basic questions when, where, and how. They just like that go away, for which in my case, that is not worth to me. So that is why I always start with definition when where and how I go as per the process so that things and objects become simple it is like making all the complicated one into a sm simple thing where it is like an atom oh small things split them into many particles this is it now you would have understood about when where and how so let us get into the topic this is about a story which is called a firefly which gives uh, the beauty of the lights well this story is related to a fly or insect which comes from the inside of the body through the chemical reaction to produce lights now, you would have seen an insect called fireflies. 
because fireflies are located everywhere now why i chosen this topic is that it is to understand how this firefly has made the day of a small boy during his tough time this is a story now let us see the definition of firefly it is a kind of insect which produces light through a fire it is consists of 2000 different species but they are also called as fireflies or lighting bugs but they are not poisonous and they can't fly faster like birds now you would have come to know that what is fireflies is about which means it produces light through fire now in your houses you might have uh, lights LED lights or so much small small bulbs to produce right but inside that bulb there will be a filament which consists of a chemical component that is mercury but here it is fire just imagine but when we see it it will be a very tiny particle like an atom where that insect will not be visible only its light will be visible to our eyes this is the basic definition of firefly. Now, why should we use this insect in case of an emergency when there are no electrical appliances? Because in this case, we are coming to say that when there are uh, no any electronic equipments, now imagine before I before I conclude this, I will tell you how this history of Firefly became a success. Because once I tell in history, surely you guys can understand why this Firefly is important. During in olden times, somewhere in the mid 1950s, 1980 uh, or 20s, somewhere, they don't have electricity anywhere, and there are no resources available. But what could we do? When the sun sets, when the sun is set, sets, and during the night time, what will a person do when it is when he is in the night? And suppose he is in a room, the room is pitch black, he cannot see anything, isn't it? So what happens is that that fireflies helped to save the lives of people in olden times to give lights. So slowly it changed right now we will now see a story about a small boy who felt happy after seeing a firefly here it is once upon a time there's a small kid sitting in a garden and playing baseball in the backyard of his house with his friend now what what it means to tell you is that there is a as i said there is a beautiful house where this small boy is sitting and what he is doing he is playing with his uh, friend baseball a game called baseball from morning to evening why he is playing baseball because it is his favorite game until the sun sets but suddenly after playing baseball and other games they went to dinner so what happens was when the night time comes they went for dinner to eat and these the, this boy and his friend are very close friends to each other they used to play uh, baseball they used to play games they used to study with each other which means together by helping one and one it is like helping when you when you don't have anything you may give something if he doesn't have i give something it is like that and when it comes to help what it happens was when when he doesn't have something he will provide him and when i doesn't have something he will provide me it is like an inverse 
No. After all this, the sun, the, the night comes. The sun has set it. The entire sky, the entire sky, or the country, has become a dark. Because in this planet, everywhere, this time varies. Now, what was the time when they were supposed to have dinner? The time was 9 p.m. They sat for the dinner and ate. Now, after all these things, his friend went home to take rest, which means he called it as a day. With my friend, for the day I spent with my friend. But now, this boy, what he is doing after having, having his dinner for about 15 minutes from 9 to 9.15 p.m. It was about 15 minutes. So, what it says is here is that he has finished his dinner. But after, after from 9.15, for about an half an hour, say the time was 9.45 p.m., there was a big nightmare occurred, which means the power has gone off, which means no electrical appliances didn't work, there was no power anywhere. And there was a small inverter which doesn't work properly, it drained out due to some problem. So what happened was this boy was struggling to search the book in a room because it was the room was an entire pitch black where he could not able to see anything. Because you imagine yourself when you live in a pitch black room, you can't able to see anything, isn't it? This is the same thing this applies in this story. But suddenly the room was pitch black where he cannot see anything. The finally raised this boy as raised statement is that somebody can you help me? Because I want a book which is very important. Where he was struck. But suddenly, after five minutes or ten minutes, his life became happy. How? Because the firefly entered his house and showed the light where the book is. He got the book finally. So this is how uh, the story, how the firefly made the beauty of a light of a small boy which helped him during the tough time. So from this, you can able to understand when the, during the night time, when you want such kind of help, you should understand how this firefly helped this small boy to make his day. That's that's the story ends. Finally, the fireflies made the day of that kid and it gave light when there is no power. This is it. I'll see you in the next video with a new topic. Still then, bye-bye. Keep on watching.